New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio danced with his wife in Times Square before midnight on New Year's Eve while keeping the rest of New York out of the famed plaza for the first time history as he enforced coronavirus restrictions. De Blasio had closed off Times Square to the hundreds of thousands who typically gather in Times Square, Reuters reported. Mayor Bill de Blasio and police officials have told New Yorkers and out-of-towners alike to stay away and watch pared-down festivities on television. A large contingent of police officers will barricade the area to prevent unauthorized people from gathering, aiming to prevent an event that could accelerate the spread of the virus in a city already struggling to contain it. It's going to be actually, arguably, the most special, the most poignant, the most moving New Year's Eve, de Blasio, who will push the button to start the Crystal's Ball descent, told reporters. In 2021, we're going to show people what it looks like to recover, to come back. So the sight of the mayor and his wife, Shirlane McRae, dancing to celebrate the new year while barring others from the square enraged viewers, particularly after the mayor's office added insult to injury by tweeting a video of the event. At one point during CNN's broadcast of the event, guest host Andy Cohen joined in the general condemnation of de Blasio. De Blasio retweeted the video of himself dancing in an empty Times Square, apparently oblivious to the mounting criticism. 